and welcome to another California guy video with your boy California guy what's up everybody and welcome to this video this video is going to be entitled about Jay-Z 444 video and the motivations behind Jay-Z's 444 video um, now a lot of people who's followed Cali guy for a couple of years or know me in my real life knows how I feel about Jay-Z Jay-Z is one of the most overrated New York rappers in the history of hip hop, I think that he's garbage. That I, I never liked his music like that, except for like Reasonable Doubt. Um, I'm not a big fan of his music. He's had hits, but not a fan of him or his music. But recently, he's came out with this 444 uh, album, and you know a lot of people of uh, you know conscious community and a lot of uh, pro blacks, uh, they really support. Uh, the 444 video that he does is okay to me. It's okay. I'm not a hater. I like the message that he's putting out, but I'm tr I'm here to break down the motivation of why Jay Z is going into this route. And Jay Z, I believe, is going into this route. It goes back to Barack Obama when he was president and his wife Beyonce, and a lot of the stuff that was going on with those two. I know for a lot of years, people have called Beyonce a coon, you know, Beyonce has always never claimed to be a black woman. And these are facts, this is not something that Cali Guy made up off the top of his head. You know, Beyonce uh, has claimed to not be a African American woman, she's always said she was Creole or all this different shit there. Um, so that was basically Beyonce's claim to fame, was doing just that. Now, as the years went on, last few years, it's like the Mariah Carey thing, you know, because a lot of these black female celebs that's not, they got dark skin, a lot of them that's not dark, that's a little lighter, or like Beyonce have exotic kind of looks, they tend to say that they're not black, they tend, because that's what the dominant society tends to dictate in people's heads, that black beauty, black there's no such thing as a beauty in black. So the beauty in being black is you have to be mixed with a lot of nationalities in order to have the beauty. So that's basically what Beyonce, but that was the trap that Beyonce was in. So as years went on, Beyonce started supporting Black Lives Matter. She started having, you know, when they had these shootings, you know, Beyonce had the Panthers, the infamous 49er game. And, you know, when she had all, uh, the 40, not the 49er game, I'm sorry, the Super Bowl in Santa Clara. But she had the, the Black Panther females and that pissed off a lot of, you know, white people. And, you know, when she was celebrating black females, you had people like Tony Lauren. You had all these white supremacist trolls uh, say that, you know, she's a certain, you know, that she's a certain way. And I think this is a result in Jay-Z's album. Because Jay-Z and Beyonce have been wanting to show people that, you know, they're part of the game. You know, these are pro-black. And I think it's Solange. Too. And then a little bit of Solange, because Solange has really celebrated her culture. Shout out to Solange, because Solange is a true blue uh, pro-black female. So, you know, because uh, people don't understand the concept, again, of being pro-black. And pro-black doesn't mean, per se, fist bumping or having hella dreads. It's about the ideal. But that's another video for another time. So the motivation of the 444 video, I think, is a personal thing for Jay-Z. And Jay-Z got tired. Uh, people calling him names because Jay Z's been mixed in Hollywood for about a decade now. He's been Mr. Hollywood for a decade. Uh, he let Gwyneth Paltrow say nigga in his face, and he, you know, he had no explanation. So, you know, I think this is his coming of age video and, and coming of age album. And a lot of people, you know, you got some black people saying they don't like it, which I don't get that, you know. And then some of them I know, some YouTuber, black YouTubers. There's, you know, allies of mine that's saying that they don't like it. The other ones say they do like it. But again, I that's I think that's the motivation behind this whole 444 video uh, is to let out a lot of stuff that's been on Jay-Z's mind. People like Kanye West, you know, who's a coon, uh, you know, people like that. Because Kanye has sold out a long time ago. Um, so that's the real reason why the 444 video has come out. A lot of African-American people... Or, you know, coming out with this wake up movement. And I think Jay-Z woke up. So, this is a short video, people. Rapid fire video. 
Uh, subscribe, like, and share. Peace out.